Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today on December 18th with a LEGO City update. Yes, I know I missed November and it's been two months since my last City update. But stuff has actually changed this time. I'm like, because if I would have updated in November, I would have been missing half my buildings because the brick fed Ottawa. They hadn't been put back in yet. And nothing really had changed. But this month, there are new changes. There are new changes in the entire layout. I know it's messy and I know you guys don't really like messy city updates. But this time I had no choice because today just snuck right up on me. And I had to film it. So the first change is I moved this small table from over there, from over here, like the one that's here, from over there. So now the ocean just goes straight out. I moved it over here because my new NCIS building needed a basement area because it's got building, like offices in the basement. Yeah, so I, and I guess I forgot to tell you, I built a new NCIS building. This is my new NCIS building lot. It's a lot different than the last one. It still has the same NCIS thing at the front. So this time you walk upstairs, there's the doorway. Three stories and it looks so much more like the original building. It's very cool. It's got, here's the inside. It's got a bunch of new, new features and one of the main ones that I'm really excited about is lights. So I've added these emergency lights here and here. So, and then I've even added some sa a sound box. So I just thought that kind of added like, you know, a little, cool little feature to my NCIS building. Worked hard on that. That was, I wanted to just try something new. Same style of roof. The hospital has been moved here as well as this the cell phone tower and then this little space farm there's a road leading out there with the train tracks the train tracks here are elevated which is pretty cool I, well, I like elevated tracks the uh, fire department's there the police station's there the corner gas mock is here it's a little broken but I'm fixing it and then that's where the road is the shopping center's still the same except this part where the Grand Emporium was, it's gone and there's actually a railroad in it because the railroad had to circle somewhere. Here is this going to be like a park area with the beach. Kind of hard to get over there. I'm, I'm a little cramped in here. But we've got like a waterfall and just a little cool thing. I'm going to work on that. The main change though was actually my new park. Here's a quick overview of the park. There, walk up these doors from the Grand Emporium and they actually open up. I'm not sure why they're closed. I'm so I'm leaving them open so you can come in the park. And it's this nice little park. It's got a museum here over here. A fireplace to like warm up. We have like a fountain, an apple tree, a really big tall tree with a monkey. Some Christmas decorations. A huge Christmas tree in the center. Another little fireplace. A park bench. Another tree this little Christmas scene and another really tall tree basically and then it's all decorated for Christmas so basically here in the center I'm actually gonna have like a new theme or so every month or and then the times like so if it's Halloween maybe I'll have a huge Halloween pumpkin and if it's Easter maybe I'll have an Easter bunny something seasonal but in the times that I don't really have any holiday seasons I'm just gonna put this Jeffrey the giraffe from Toys R Us because I really like that Again, apologize for the mess, but I everything that was here and everything that was here has been thrown here and back here because I've been trying to get some actual progress done, and I'm quite happy with my progress. Got some more stuff to do. The road is, been, is going to be turned into a, I don't know, it's either going to be a one-way or still a two-way. Not really sure how that's going to go yet. We'll find out. I think it's probably going to be just a one-way. like. Because it's not, it's, here's, it's very thick here, and it's easy to get two vehicles, but then it narrows here, and it's narrow here, it's pretty narrow back here, and it's extremely narrow over here, 
And it's just the way it is, so it's probably going to be a one-way street. Maybe two lanes when you get to up here to go move traffic faster, and then back to one. I'm working on it. It's all changing. I got because I got another base plate for my birthday. I was able to make the water three base plates instead of two. I've got to upgrade the sand a little more, and then make this cool little waterfall. So there's going to be water up here, down the waterfall here, and slowly right into the ocean, river, pond, lake, whatever you want it to be. And then I get to have some boats in a marina, and it's just going to be a cool little thing. Not sure if the shopping center is going to change at all. There's only a few stores now. It's going to change because I don't like seeing the back of the pizza place. I'll move that, but other than that, not, not too much. It's been a six minute video, and you've seen all the changes already. So thanks a lot for watching this December 18th LEGO City update. Apologize for missing November, 2000, November 18th, but I will be back hopefully for January 18th. Thanks a lot for watching. Go check out all my other city updates, all my other videos, and have a great day.